start, I have a question for you guys. Which laptop are you using right now and what is your opinion on it? Let me know in the comments. Number 5. HP 15 – Best for Most People While the top and the bottom as well as the edges of the affordable HP 15 are made of metal, the areas around the keyboard and display are made of a more affordable-looking plastic. The transitions between the materials are even, but they are very visible. The manufacturer forgoes extremely thin bezels to some extent, making the bezel above the display slightly thicker. However, this also means that the webcam does not need to wander to some more exotic place. The lid opening angle is limited to about 140 degrees and the hinges hold the lid tightly in place. The HP 15 does not have any maintenance flaps and opening the case turns out to be very difficult, so only experienced users should make any attempt to open a notebook. The risk of damaging the case of our test unit was too high for us. It's hard to look past the HP 15 laptop's dull and dim 15.6-inch display when its resolution is only 1366 by 768. We're willing to get over poor displays on budget and mainstream laptops, but it's most disappointing when a notebook can't manage 1920 by 1080. It has a Pentium Gold 6405U with 32GB of DDR4 RAM, which is great for everyday usage. The HP 15 is a very capable laptop. I don't really think you could ask for a much better spec for the price. Number 4. HP Envy X360 – Best 2-in-1 Laptop Moving on, we have the HP Envy X360. This one has a beautiful all-metal design with thin screen bezels, has a great audio quality, a long-lasting battery life, and many other amazing features that'll make you take a look at it. Plus, it's not as pricey as other premium laptops. It has an AMD 6-core Ryzen 5 4500U processor, it has an 8GB 2400MHz DDR4 SD RAM and 256GB of PCIe solid-state drive. It has one USB 3.1 Type-C port, two USB 3.1 ports, an HDMI port, one microphone headphone combo jack, and one micro SD media card reader. Its operating system is the Windows 10 Home. Also, its graphics coprocessor is an AMD Radeon Vega 8. The performance is amazing on this one. HP Envy X360 offers a lot at this price. It's great for multimedia, games, and so on. It's not designed for games, but you can play some games on it from time to time without a problem. The average battery life of this laptop is 11 hours, which is great. It's a good laptop overall with many great features that'll help you finish your everyday tasks without a problem. If you've decided to buy a laptop as a student, you should check this one out and see if this is the laptop you were looking for. Number 3. Acer Aspire 5 Slim – Best Under $500 The Aspire 5 is an amazing 15-inch laptop that's not very expensive and has a great performance. It's very thin and weighs less than 4 pounds. It also has a great battery life for the price. If you're looking for an inexpensive 15-inch laptop, the Aspire 5 might be the one for you. It has a 1920 by 1080 resolution display and the IPS panel gives solid viewing angles. It has an AMD Ryzen 3 3300U dual-core processor up to 3.5GHz with a 4GB of RAM and 128GB of SSD. It also has the AMD Radeon Vega 3 mobile graphics. On the right side, it has USB 2.0 Type-A port and a combo audio jack. On the left, it has a pair of USB 3.0 Type-A ports along with Gigabit Ethernet. A USB 3.1 Gen 1 Type-C port and an HDMI port are there as well. It has a great performance, it's amazing for multimedia and things like that, and you can play some games from time to time on the Aspire 5 without a problem. The battery life of this laptop is great. It'll last you up to 10 hours. It's a good laptop overall with an amazing performance and a beautiful and simple design. Check this one out if you want an inexpensive laptop that delivers great performance and many more amazing features. Number 2. Lenovo Legion 5 – Best Gaming Laptop Lenovo rebranded its mid-range and high-end gaming laptops into the Legion line a few years ago, and we've been great fans. The Legion line and the Legion Wi-Fi 30 in particular were formidable entries in 2019, and for 2021 the Legion 5 takes the line to newer heights. In looks, the Legion 5 shares the same busy look as its predecessor, the Legion Y series, despite coming in as a rebrand. However, the chunky profile of 0.9 inches thick and 5.41 pounds doesn't quite match the minimalist design of competitors like the Asus ROG Zephyrus M at 0.78 inches and 4.39 pounds. 
The Legion 5 sports a 15.6-inch 1920x1080 IPS screen that's a step above budget in both brightness and color, while at the same time rocking a 144Hz 100% sRGB display that's perfect for speedy frame rates. The Legion 5's AMD Ryzen 7 4800H CPU and 8GB of RAM will handle most of your productivity tasks with unmatched ease. In fact, it can drown 40 Google Chrome tabs, including a Twitch live stream, a Netflix film, and a 1080p YouTube video without lagging at all. The impressive performance is further boosted by the speedy 512GB SSD storage that adds to impressive processing speeds. It definitely is one of the best laptops for architects in the market, and you should check it out. Number 1. Apple MacBook Air M1 – Best All Round The MacBook Air is the first of two new laptops with Apple's first-of-its-kind own brand M1 processor, which makes for a giant leap in performance and battery life. From the outside, almost nothing about the M1 MacBook Air has changed since the one from April. They match in size and weight, the number of ports, microphones, and speakers. The 13.3-inch supports the wider DCI-P3 color space, a feature hitherto reserved for the more expensive MacBook Pro. The inside of the Air is almost exactly the same as its predecessor too, apart from one very important part. The processor, or more accurately, the System on a Chip, or SOC, which combines processor, graphics, and RAM all in one package. The new M1 replaces the Intel Core i3, i5, or i7 of its predecessor, in the cheapest MacBook Air, as tested, it has an 8-core processor or CPU and a 7-core graphics processor or GPU. With 8GB of RAM and 256GB of storage, but an 8-core GPU option also available. The M1 has four high-performance CPU cores that handle the demanding stuff such as crunching data and editing photos, while four high-efficiency CPUs handle lightweight tasks such as sending emails. Apple declared its M1 chip would enable all-day battery life, and the company has hit that mark. This MacBook Air really is one of the best business laptops in the market, without a doubt. Buying Guide Budget You probably know that different brands deliver different quality with their laptops, and if you stick with the big-name brands, you're assured to get a good laptop that'll get the job done. However, your budget will also be a significant factor when buying a new laptop. For that reason, try to find a balance between quality and price, but still, don't sacrifice on the specs and features you need. It's better to wait a while to get a better laptop than to buy the first laptop you can afford. Size Most laptops come in screen sizes that range from 11 to 17 inches. The entire system is sized to fit the display. That means smaller notebooks are lighter and more compact, and larger ones are bulkier. If you don't move the laptop much, a 15-inch model is fine, but if you plan to use the laptop on your lap or carry it around, a model with a 13- or 14-inch screen like the Dell XPS 13 may provide the best balance between screen space and portability. Display The more pixels you have, the more content you can fit on screen, and the sharper it'll look. Sadly, some budget laptops still have 1366 x 768 displays, and so do a few business laptops. But if you can afford it, we recommend paying extra for a panel that runs at 1920 x 1080, also known as Full HD or 1080p. Higher-end laptops have screens that are 2560 x 1600, 3200 x 1800, or even 3840 x 2160 or 4K, which all look sharp but consume more power, therefore lowering your